Hello didgeridoo players of the world! Today we are going to do the simplest didgeridoo exercise in the universe. All you need to have is this PVC tube or a good didgeridoo. Um, this is one and a half meter and I chose this because we will have to play the drone and it is high enough so that you can still play drone easily. But it is low enough so that you can play the trumpet tone the toot also quite easily so i would say that is maybe the perfect ratio to have both again the drone is the fundamental the deepest note that you can have and the toot is that higher frequency when you press your lips tighter all right the exercise is very, very simple. We will go in four beat bar. The first beat will be DA, the drone. Then you will have break where you can breathe in. Then you have TA, the toot, on the third position. Then you have another break to breathe on the fourth position. So you go DA, TA, DA, TA, DA, TA. Okay? On the dig, it sounds like this. Sometimes I exhale through the nose because when I'm inhaling, I'm inhaling quite a lot so that you can see it, but you don't have to inhale that much. A small inhalation is more than enough. So this is how I would play it if I do not exaggerate the breathing. All right, so that is your bass line. Drone, break, toot, break. The second line is the extended drone. So it will be DAO, TA, DAO, TA. So you have DAO, extended drone, then the toot, then break. Okay, on the digit, it sounds like this. And these two lines are in a very logical correlation. So you can play them together very easily, and you should. Do not underestimate the simplicity of this exercise, because it will allow you to embed good breathing patterns. And if you don't have circular breathing yet, this will help you immensely, and it will help you to uh, establish good transitions of the lips, so from the drone to toot and back. The third line is the extended toot, so you have drone, break, tawa. Okay? And again, this is very easy to combine with the line number one. You should do. A more tricky thing to do would be to combine lines two and three, but still you can do it very easily, right? And the line four will be to have extended drone and the toot. Dawa 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 dawa. So it sounds like this. If you repeat only that line, you will have to have circular breathing to get it going for a while. However, when you combine it with other lines, well, you can breathe in all those breaks. And when you're doing this dawa, I recommend that you move your jaw down and up, or tawa, jaw down and up, and eventually your breathing will be able to fit there. So you should do combinations of these four lines, one, two, one, three, two, three, one, four, Two, four, three, four, one, two, three, four, and go through these combinations. Be patient with yourself. I would recommend that you put on a metronome 
at 120 BPM and it will help you to keep the regularity of your beats. Remember, when you're lost, come back to line number one. Be patient with yourself. Give yourself time to adjust as well. Your body needs to achieve this balance of breathing, but also your lips need to be able to drone and to it properly. So, please let me know in the comments how it went for you. Spiral out. Keep digging.